Are you a subject matter expert who struggles to speak with confidence? Are you losing career opportunities and feeling stuck because of your stage fear and nervousness during presentations? Isn't that affecting your happiness and your family's future? Welcome to the Confident Man Show with Mr. Bashal Sarkar, India's celebrity expert in practical public speaking, where he shows you how to speak with confidence, deliver rock-solid confident presentations, in front of decision makers without any stage fear. Would you like to become the confident man, gain more respect, and enjoy a happy life? Then listen carefully because this is showtime. For knowing more about the upcoming practical public speaking courses and opportunities to get mentored by Mr. Bishal himself, go to bishalsarkar.com. Again, you can go to bishalsarkar.com for more information about having a conversation with our team members about your situation. Show starts now. Three, two, one, let's go. Do you think you're being too busy? Walking around and running around getting all your jobs done but still not getting time? Still not being worthy enough? Hey, this is Anupama Chatterjee and today we are discussing three reasons why you are busy but not financially secure and we are in conversation with Mr. Bishal Sarkar who is the author of the book I Love Public Speaking and creator of the Confident Speaker Conference. So Bishal, why do you think people don't have enough time? They are so busy running around, walking around, getting their jobs done but they are not hitting their destination. Absolutely and in fact that's a great a great start to, to talk about it because most people today do not have enough time for themselves. You know, there is a big opportunity today in the world, Anupama. The opportunity to really live with passion, to live with power, and to sleep with peace. In fact, what we do at the Confident Speaker Conference is we help people become a confident speaker so that you can, like subject matter experts who you're listening, you can reach the highest level in your career by becoming a strong leader so that you can enjoy more time freedom with your family while having greater level of social respect and so that you can live with happiness for the rest of your life without stress, struggle, and sacrifice. Now, while we teach that to people, many times I see a big problem. The problem that many people, even though they are knowledgeable experts, even though they have level of great experience, knowledge, years of, you know, a lot of certifications, they are not getting the right level of um, recognition. You know why that happens? Yes, because I think people, while being so busy, sometimes they miss it. And then later they realize that, oh my God, I worked so hard but I didn't get that respect that I was looking for. Yeah, that definitely is a reason. Another reason is they don't know how to manage their own priority. You know, people talk a lot about time management. The, the problem that we have today is we have so many different options, and we're going to talk more about it later on. Um, in fact, what I teach inside the Balanced Life Mastermind is actually helping people gain more time from their life. Now, you, don't, you have the 24 hours. You know, nobody has 26, nobody has 25. But how do you maximize the time that you have? We talk about it, but... In fact, this is one of the conversations that I was having with one of the team members and one of the one of the members of the mastermind, you know, one of my clients, um, Mahesh, when he first came to came oh, yes, to me, he Mahesh. was uh, yeah, he's from Maharashtra. You know, he came down um, to to Bangalore to attend the confident speaker. And he conference. was always telling us that, you know, Anupama, I feel we have very less time. Yeah. I don't feel I have enough time. We Absolutely. have only 24 hours. In fact, he told me that Anupama, if I had 26 <coughs> hours, 28 hours, I think that would be amazing for me. Yeah, it would be amazing for me too, but that doesn't <laughs> happen. So, so one thing that I, that I taught Mahesh is actually how to say no to more things. So anytime people come to you, you don't, you don't always say yes uh, to them, but as a result of today, after 15 months of mentoring, uh, Mahesh is having more time freedom than than ever before. His um, he has sent his daughter to the Symbiosis School for Mass Communication Studies, and he's a happier person than ever before. In fact, I got a question for you, dear listener: Would you like similar results? Do you want more confidence, more happiness, and more time freedom? If yes, we're about Anupama right now. We're about to give all the people listening to the show, three reasons why they might be busy but not financially secure. Okay, you ready, Anupama? Yes, I would like to know, like, you are giving sure. us three reasons, but what is the biggest reason? What is the biggest out of all those three? Um, all three are the biggest ones. I mean, if you, it's like saying which hand is more important, right or left. But we are talking about three hands here. Yeah. 
<laughs> so all three hands are absolutely equally important here. So no pun intended. So the first reason I think is most people, if you're listening to the show, you are working hard on the wrong things. Okay. You are working hard on the wrong things. Now, what what, what do you mean by that, Bishal? Well, so you know, we, I, after working with a lot of people, a lot of professionals who come to me for coaching and mentoring, one thing it's one thing that's very clear to me is that most people are not productive. Interesting. Yeah, most people, they, they are active, but they're not productive. So they wake up in the morning, they do the chores at house, they get dressed, they eat the breakfast, they, they take the shower. Hopefully, they take the shower. Uh, they, <laughs> they, they have the breakfast, they pack the lunch, uh, they drop the kids to the school, they take the car or the cab or the bus or an Ola or an Uber. They go to the office and they, they work, 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 work. And in between the work, they are checking the emails all the time. Every single time there's a WhatsApp message, they're checking it. They are they are going from meeting to 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 meeting. They're going on Google, going to back to email. They're, oh, that phone call, that SMS, that thing. They're working a lot, but they're working on the wrong things. That's why they are not financially secure. So here's what happens. At the end of the day, here is how they feel when they come back home. Oh my God, I'm so tired. I worked so hard. Always. But on the wrong things, right? It's like, if you want to be a... If you want to be a footballer, um, you doing you reading about football, you watching football, all those things doesn't matter. One thing matters: what you're eating, how you're training, and what you're doing once you're in the ground. Michael Phelps, one of the best swimmers in the world, he said, "My schedule is very simple: I wake up and I get into the swimming pool. That's it. See, that's that's called focus. You need to have focus in your life. So instead of checking the email." Ask yourself, you know, what do I need to do in order to receive the financial security? How can I improve my career? How can I go to the next level? How can I get the promotion? How can I start a business? How can I start a multiple streams of income? Most people don't do that. That's why they're spending too much time in email meeting this, that, WhatsApp, Facebook, this, that. And as a result, they feel exhausted, tired, but they are not able to take that vacation. You know, I know you're taking your, your family for vacation, right? So tell us about it quickly. So we are going to Kashmir yeah. and I'll come to it. But, but the Bishan, heaven whatever's... on <laughs> land. The heaven on earth. And yeah. Bishal, what I was going to say, I, I don't really don't want to miss it, is because I've been watching you closely, Bishal. I've been working with you very, very closely. And what I have seen... Very closely. Very and, closely. <laughs> and what I have uh, observed in you is that you are highly organized in terms of your work schedule. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And the reason that you get so much work done in so much less time is because you organize your tasks very, very easily. Yeah. Yeah. And... Uh, you were saying that people come home after doing 18 hours of work, they feel tired, exhausted, and they do not have time for They don't have the juice anymore, right? No. They don't have the emotional juice anymore, yeah. No. And that's why I think, like you said, vacation is important as well. And like you were asking, I'm going to Kashmir yeah. in the next month, and we're going to have an amazing, amazing time with my family. Yeah. And Kashmir has always been my dream because it is the heaven on earth, like yeah. you said. And I'm also going to the most uh, desirable place in India because people come there from all over the earth and that place is Benares. It that's what I like about list. you, you know, that's what I, which is a lot of people are working. You know, you have your own business now set up apart from working with me. You know, you, you teach, you, you have your fitness consulting business that you're running. One thing, uh, by the way, people can go to onupamachatterjee.com and find out more about what she's doing on her own uh, for, for fitness. And um, one thing I like about you is that you, you take the time to spend the quality time with your family. You know, a lot of people, you know, you remember the conversation you and I had last year before you took your family to, to Andaman. I mean, when I say family, I mean your parents to yes. Andaman. Um, and, uh, you know, you are a little worried about the money part. Uh, money and plus, you know, should I go? Should I not? It's a big, you know, investment expense wise. And I remember we having a conversation and you having a mindset shift and you said, you know, I'm going. And no matter how much money and, and going to Andaman there, 
and staying there for a few days, not just in a cheap way, but you stayed in a good way as much as you could. And it, it's expensive money wise. And you could do yes. that because you are working on the right things instead of people who are working on the wrong things. You know, they go on vacation once in four years and um, and, and just all they do is that bra- brag about it on Facebook. Here is the photo. Here. No, you got to be happy. The thing, you have to focus on what you want to do. If you're going yeah. on a vacation, if you want to travel, you should focus on the travel. You're not going to focus on here, how I went, absolutely. where I stayed. Absolutely. And, and you know, thank you. And I want to interrupt you. Here is why. Most people, when they even go for vacation, because they are, their mind is not right, they're still checking their email during that vacation. You How know? is that a vacation Yeah, anymore? so it's like, it's like I'm going on the beach, but I got to post it on Facebook right now so people know that I finally came for the vacation. See, that's oh, I why checked in. I checked in I into checked one of the in. months. I checked in into Port Blair. I checked in into Havelock. I checked in into Neil. Cheapest <laughs> hotel in the city. That they don't talk about. Yeah, that they don't talk about. So, um, so yeah, that's one thing. You know, you got to, most people are working on the wrong thing. So that's reason number one why you, dear listener, may, or maybe somebody you know, is having that financial problem even if even if they're busy so that's point number one point number two is if you're busy but not financially secure it can be for this reason number two which is you set your value by comparing yourself with average people all the time yeah it's it's a very uh, common reason most most times which is basically i should buy alto because my friends have bought pretty much close to Alto, or I should be paid 1.5 lakhs rupees because the people who studied with me or have similar experience get paid 1.5 lakhs rupees a month. You gotta set your own value. You know, value is an important thing. It's we're not talking about just asking for money. If the reason you are not financially secure, many times I talk about it, is your mental. You have mental blocks about money. Your relationship with money is not right. You think money doesn't make you happy, brother. I got a news for you. Money doesn't make you happy. Not having money also doesn't make you happy. Boom. It's better to have money and not need it than to need money and not have it. So how can you how can you set your own value? I'm going to give an example. You ready, Anupama? Yes. You know, when, when I went out to um, become, you know, a speaker, trainer, many people were charging small money. I, I st- definitely in the beginning, I, my, my value, my self-value, self-worth was low. And after that, I said, you know what? I'm going to ask for a, ask for a big amount for, for um, coaching and mentoring. Make sense? Totally. There's a reason, Bashal, why you are the highest paid public speaker in India. Yeah, and, and yeah, I am. And I'm grateful for that. It's not a level of arrogance or not a statement of arrogance for me. It's, it's, it's just it's a, setting yeah, your own value. You were talking absolutely. about value. Absolutely. You know, just a few days ago, I remember, um, you know, there is a small little group coaching uh, that I do. Um, the investment for the program is six lakhs rupees. Um, just the, the lowest level. And in one of my masterminds, and a guy came to me and he said, hey, um, at the event, you know, hey, I want to join your mastermind, but I can't pay six lakhs. Can I pay four? I said, so you want the king of confidence to lower his value. What kind of an asshole mentor is he going to be for you if he lowers <laughs> his own value? And and he laughed about it. And I said, sorry, I can't do that. It's not because of the discount thing. I, I can I can, you know, lower things for people who are really serious. But the thing is, I need to set my own value. If you are a father, if you are a mother and you want your children to learn value, uh, from you, if you want them to be confident, you got to be confident. If you want them to set their own value, you need to do that for yourself. So stop comparing yourself with other people. Just because somebody else is getting 80,000 rupees doesn't mean you can't get two lakhs rupees. Just because somebody else um, is not able to pay for that great vacation does not mean that you can't pay for that great vacation. So instead of comparing yourself with other people, Average people, you got to compare yourself with big people. I think, Bishal, you're right. Because when people go out to shopping with their wives and they go to these malls... To, to their wives. <laughs> <laughs> Multiple wives. <laughs> to, uh, to, in general, you're saying, okay, okay. To their yeah, I'd love to have wives. Okay, how many? Yeah, two is fine. <laughs> so when people go out on shopping with their wives in the weekends mm-hmm. and they're like shopping at lifestyle and pantaloons and these brands and there's a great sale and they're like, hey, honey, let's go. There's a shopping sale going on. Let's go and grab all the good things. But have you ever thought that lifestyle, I'm not uh, criticizing lifestyle at all. That's a lifestyle brand. Mm-hmm. But lifestyle will give you a 50% discount or a 30% discount. But you don't look for discount when you're going to Gucci. You don't go to discounts for Ferragamo. Yeah. You never do that. 
because they have created their own standards they have created their own value they have the legacy which you cannot compromise they have never compared themselves with the average and if you are thinking dear listener that hey that's gucci that's lamborghini that's this big brand i can't be that no that's the thing you got to you got to believe in your own value you have to see yourself as the gucci you are the gucci of your industry you are the lamborghini of your community you are the big person you got to be you got to act like it you know one of my mentors jason lister talks about it he said before you um before you are treated like a one of a kind you have to act like the one of a kind so you have to walk like it you have to talk like it you have to feel like it you have to speak like it so just imagine for a second now you're listening to the show if you started doubling your value inside your mind your confidence your own value your courage if you do that though do you think people's confidence will be higher anuma absolutely do you think their own self value is going to go higher great do you think they will uh, stop wasting more time totally absolutely they're not going to see a person of value doesn't spend one and a half hours on facebook or email i know a lot of people they wake up and they check their email just and i was one of those people for many years until just a few you know a little while ago i decided one of my 12 rules to live by now is i check email once a day it's at 10:30 a.m. once a day i used to check my uh, email all the time on the phone because i had notifications i killed all those notifications from the phone i check email once a day it's like a task it's not a fantasy for me anymore so if you want to be fine how do you think bill gates is checking email 25 times a day no he doesn't have time because he's doing bigger things he probably doesn't even have an email address maybe he has somebody who checks his email for him you want to be the bill gates of your, bill gates of your industry you got to think feel train and act like the bill gates of your industry in that case so that's reason number 2 and reason number 3 for for which most people are busy but not financially free is because they are hanging out not with financially free people so i got to ask a question to you are you hanging out with financially free people what's totally. the gym what's the gym round quote anupama when you and because I, let me see if you remember you become who you hang out with absolutely you become who you hang out with you hang out with five great people you become the sixth one you bec- you hang out with five average people you become the sixth person absolutely so you become who you hang out with see that's the reason i created the confident speaker conference that's the reason i created the balanced life mastermind <clears throat> so people can hang out with me and my members and the people who are already winning big you know all the people who are winning big in life so my question to you right now is Dear listener, check your phone for a second. Check your phone and see the last five people that you called. How many of them are financially free? And how many of them are broke? Reality check. That's a reality check. Five people. You you become who you hang out with. You become the average of the five people you surround yourself with. So these are the three reasons. So let's go over them. Number one, you're working on the wrong things. Okay. Number two, you set your value by comparing yourself to with average people, and number three, you're hanging out with wrong people. You know, you got to hang out with financially free people. I can pretty much promise to you, um, Anupam. I can pretty much promise to the people if you change these three things, you will absolutely not just be busy, but you're going to be financially secure very, very soon. So before we go, I'd love to quickly tell people about the conference. Okay. the confident speaker conference the number one most practical public speaking course in this world for people who are subject matter experts now there is a reason why we de- don't take app, you know beginners and freshers in this program why is that anupama dear listeners please listen to this carefully because we do, we are not being rude here we want to be serious and for the people to get the ultimate and the most important experience it is important for them to be surrounded with the like minded people Yeah, because like Mr. <clears throat> Bishal said, you become who you hang out with. Yeah. So the thing is, if if people with fifteen years of experience who want to grow, they are already successful professionally, personally. Now they want to improve their speaking skills and go to the next level in their career because they feel stuck. If they are hanging out with freshers, guess what? They're gonna have that fresher mentality. The beginning, I don't know. My God, too much. This that. those bo- i don't i don't attract energy like that into the program so i do have all my best wishes for the freshers the newbies and this that but my goodness this is not for them you know this is not for them so college is not for primary school kids you you, you- we are not being rude to you freshers but you have to understand that we cannot serve you in the best possible manner even if you if we took you into the confident speaker conference that's why that's why we have the subject matter expert so if you consider yourself a subject matter expert in your field if you consider yourself a, as a 
leader in your field and you know a lot, but you have difficulty. Maybe you have stage fear or maybe you're not able to connect with an audience. Maybe you're not confident speaker. Maybe you don't have the power in your voice. Maybe you don't have the natural flow in your presenting or maybe sometimes you don't get the right words at the right time to express yourself. Whatever problem that you face in communication or public speaking, if you want to amp up the game, I encourage you to come to the Confident Speaker Conference where we show you how to become a confident speaker so that you can reach the highest level in your career by becoming the, a strong leader. How you can enjoy time freedom with your family while having greater level of social respect so that you can live with happiness for the rest of your life with peace, passion, and power. That's all I got for you. What, what are we doing next week? Next week we're talking about why loving that's, yourself. No, that's a, that's a secret. We don't t- say exactly what we're speaking about <laughs> I just said week. half. So, yeah, we, we, we love for you to subscribe to the channel. Please subscribe to the channel if you like it. And Mr. Bishal, let's end this episode. Always with remember line. that it's not about perfection. It's all about connection. connection. Congratulations for listening to today's show. If you're ready to become the confident man in your own life, Go to bishalsarkar.com and apply for a conversation today. For that, go to bishalsarkar.com. All right, time for me to go. Have a confident day. Hi, I'm Deepa. I'm working as senior manager at ANZ. I think I've seen a better version of me with great confidence and I would say that I have seen a complete transformation. I've completely got rid of the stage fear and I'm able to connect with audience with greater perfection. I was not able to connect with audience. Right? I used to get, give a presentation with natural flow, but I hardly could connect with audience. I would say that I was nervous and I was losing points when, when actually giving the presentation. And I would say that it was an average presentation or average uh, uh, talk I used to give. But now I would see, say my quality of talks have really increased because I could really connect with audience. practical in nature and it's not about just presentation right it's about complete transformation of you and really giving the basics of what it really means to become a confident speaker and it's all about connection it's a wonderful course i think if you're not joining you're missing something in your life yeah so not only vishal sarkar everyone in the team is equally talented and everyone has put an additional effort uh, trying to add value and really added value to every single participant. I would say the course was very practical and not really boring as a usual uh, public speaking course or usual confident uh, building course. It was really practical and we felt involved throughout the course and really seeing a transformation day by day. I would say that what I have not achieved for years together, I have just achieved in just three days.